I not be moving through space, but I am moving through time. I mean, after all, my watch just keeps on ticking and ticking. And as long as I'm standing still, that is, not moving through space, Einstein said that all of my motion is through time. But look what happens if I walk toward that guy. We've exaggerated it, but because I'm now in motion, he'll perceive my watch ticking slower. That's because, from his perspective, some of my previous motion through time is being diverted into my motion through space. And it's not just my watch. If we really exaggerate the effect, he'd perceive all my movement, my voice, everything about me slowing down. And now that I've stopped moving, the passage of time in our watches once again agrees. This was Einstein's key insight that motion through space affects the passage of time.